Okay, brilliant. I'm going to make a start now. I've just had a message saying that you can hear an echo. So um, if the audio is good, please let me know via the chat box and then I'll make a start. Thank you. Okay, brilliant. Um, welcome everybody um, to this call. Um, I know it's been a while since I've been um, on a call, so I apologize for that. My voice is a little bit croaky, so again, I apologize for that. I'm going to keep this, um, my own section of this call, a little bit short because my voice isn't that great at the moment. So I'm going to also, uh, I've got uh, Mandeep on the call as well. So people, I'm oh, sorry, I'm just reading my messages as, as I'm going along. So yeah, um, I've got Mandeep on the call as well. So she'll do uh, uh, some training for you guys too. And yeah, thank you guys for welcoming me back into the into, into the um, group as it is. I've been away for a few weeks. Now, um, it's very, very important that this call had to happen because I don't know if you've noticed uh, in, in, in I am in, in this company, there's been a lot of people doing extremely well. And when I say extremely well, I'm talking about financial freedom. And even though we're in very, very testing times at the moment, we're in a, obviously in a lockdown. A lot of people cannot go out for, for various reasons. The company is still progressing. And people, ordinary people like you and me are doing extremely well. And that's why I, I wanted to do this call. I wanted to just let you know that we are still here for you. And it is our intention that you do very, very well in this business. Personally, I want every single person on this call to become financially free this year. And by financial freedom, I mean that you've got more money coming in than going out whether you work or not. Now, a few days ago, I wasn't feeling very well. However, because um, I get residual income, I was still getting paid every single day or every single week. And that's what I want for every single person on this call. I don't want you to be able to have to go to work or go to a job to be able to survive. So the intention is that every single person on this call in, in, in our team becomes financially free. Now, during these testing times, it's extremely important that we retain positivity. Positivity is so, so important. It doesn't matter what's going out there. It doesn't matter what the negative press is, whether you believe what's happening out there or not is, is besides the point. What you need to do is to to become positive i've just had a message saying turn off your chime so i don't actually know how to turn my chime off um so i'll, I'll go to my settings um in a few minutes and, and i will switch my my chime off uh just just bear with me a second uh i can't actually find my settings i'll, I'll come back to that in a minute so basically what, what, what i'm what i'm saying is that you need to be positive regardless of what's happening out there in the market whether you're trading or building the business, um, emotions are key. And if you are positive, you'll find that you'll absolutely smash your goals. The second point I want to raise, and I have raised this before in, in other presentations and other meetings, is that you always need to have a goal. If you do not have a goal, you are effectively running around in a circle like a headless chicken. So if you have not written your goals down today, please do so. Um, I'd advise you to spend some time, whether it's an hour, a couple of hours, <coughs> um, in, in your schedule to set yourself a goal. And this is something I, I've been doing since the beginning of time. I've always set goals I, and also I always go back to my goals to ensure that I'm headed towards my goals. If you do not know how to set your goals, um, you can speak to myself, speak to any of the other leaders and we'll help you do that post a message in the, in the group and we'll tell you and teach you and show you how to set your goals. Goal setting is so, so important that um, I would actually say that if you do not have a goal at the moment or goals at the moment, you will very, very likely not succeed. That's how important it is to set your goal. And when it comes to success, um, success is not something that you'll be able to achieve alone. You will do it with a, with a group of people around you and also, if you surround yourself with very, very successful people, like we have um, in our groups, in our teams, you are more likely to achieve your goal. So please ensure that you are surrounding yourself with successful people every single day so that you, you hit your goals. And always aim big. Don't aim for the small goals. Always aim big. If your trading goal is to, say, make £100 a day, change that to £1,000 a day. 
if you want to hit big in the ranks, if you want to become a P1000, I would change that to Chairman 10. So always aim big with your goals, surround yourself with successful people and you will hit those goals. That's what I've seen over and over and over again. And very, very important when it comes to hitting your goals is to be teachable. If you are not teachable, again, like I said before, like with goal setting, you will not make your goals happen. Teachability and the teachability index are so, so important. So please make sure that you take on board what we tell you, what we teach you. This is stuff that we've learned for years. I've, I've been in business now for over two decades and I'm learning things every single day. And it's my intention to pass this knowledge on to other people like yourselves. And you can help yourself by being teachable. The third thing I want to mention in this quick introduction is personal development. <coughs> Excuse me. You need to ensure that you are very, very personally developed. And to do that, you need to be reading a lot. Obviously readers or leaders are readers. Every single leader that you come across um, you'll find is a reader. So we, le we read an awful lot every single day. At the moment, I tend to do a lot of audio. So I listen to a lot of audio books, uh, whether it's on YouTube or in the back office, I'm, I'm learning something new every single day. So always bear in mind that leaders are readers. And if you want to make it in this business, or in fact, any other business, you need to be reading and learning something new every single day. Now, improve yourself daily and by all means you will get to your goals i'm going to pass the the baton on to mandeep now i'm just going to check to make sure she is on the call and uh let's see mandeep i'm going to unmute you hi jav can you hear me yes i can hear you and see you welcome oh my god i can't believe i'm actually seeing you that you're in front of our eyes <laughs> Mendy, you're looking good. Um, I like the office. So, thank you. Thank you. Um, it's my new move to Dubai, so I decided to settle uh, down here. Yeah. I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm also in Dubai. So, uh, <laughs> we'll grab a coffee afterwards. Sure, 100%. Let's do it. That sounds really, really good. How are you feeling? Are you better? I, I, I'm very well, thanks. My voice is a little bit croaky, but, but I'm getting there. And as long as I don't speak too much, I tend to be okay, <laughs> which okay. is good for most people. <laughs> Well, thank you very much for that introduction, Jav. Appreciate it. Um, so how is everyone doing? I mean, if you could put some sevens in the chat box, uh, let's, let's welcome Dr. Jav back. And, uh, you know, how, how, how is everyone doing? They've had a great week. Put your sevens. I need to know that you can see, you can hear me. Um, and, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's great to, to be here. Uh, finally, I think it's been about three weeks since we've all had a bit of a catch up. So I thought we'd get everyone on here. And um, I'm really super excited that Dr. Jav is back because I kept texting him and trying to phone him over the last few weeks, but he, he couldn't speak, you know, bless him. So really, really glad that you're back, Dr. Jav. Um, and, uh, you know, it, it, it's great to, to have you here. So hopefully over the next few weeks, uh, sorry, the next few days, we're wishing you a very, very speedy recovery. So welcome, 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 everybody. It's, you know, great to see you. Um, we're all part of Dr. Jav's organization on this call. And um, basically wanted to, um, you know, get everyone on this call. We like to have a team meeting every once in a while. And by the way, we can be as interactive as we want. So if you have any particular questions, then do let us know, put them in the chat box. Don't be shy. If you are extra shy and you don't want anyone to see your question, all you need to do is put, uh, send me a private message um, whilst I'm talking, or you can send Dr. Jab a private message. But the purpose of these calls is really to kind of help us understand different topics throughout the throughout the coming weeks and the months and i'm actually calling the month of may the month of overflow because i really really believe massive things are happening we can actually see the chat boxes are going crazy at the moment with all the you know the the rank the rank promotions and what have you that are going on trading is going absolutely explosive and crazy um every single person on this call from a trading point of view, let me start with that. Every single person should be making money, whether you're using Vibrata, and by the way, I am teaching Vibrata ECC level five times a week. Um, most of our TPs, sorry, most of our trades are hitting TPs, okay? I actually started learning this strategy. I was very, very, very reluctant because I'm a day trader, I like the harmonic scanner. And uh, Mr. Sandu, our chairman 25 said, you need to learn Vibrata. And I remember on the phone, being on the phone to him, true story, actually, I kind of wish he was here to hear this. 
Um, but true story, I, I said to Abdullah, oh, do you know, I'm, I'm okay. Like, I'm, I'm, I don't know, but you know, I'm, I, I don't want to learn it. Like, I'll, I'll be okay. And the truth was, I was full of fear because I thought it's a scalping tool. I'm scared. What if I lose money? What if it doesn't work? What if, what if, what if? Um, and basically, in a nutshell, he said, look, if you can teach your teams how to make money or how simple something is, wouldn't that be good? It's an extra bow. It's an extra string to your bow. And if you learn it, it can make a massive impact. And I said, okay, let me give it a go. So I tried ECC 11 for one month. And hand on heart, I've completely, completely fallen in love with this strategy. 100% fallen in love. If you have been on my call in the last few weeks on ECC 11 and you have made money, I want you to put a seven in the chat box right now. And if you haven't made money, I want you to put another number other than seven. <laughs> in the chat box um because the thing is most of our most of our um currency pairs are hitting tp they're hitting take profit and the reason why i'm so proud of that is from completely not knowing anything about scalping i can now teach it can you believe that i don't just make the money on my own and sit on it and that's it i'm saying well let me teach other people it is such a good strategy so if any of you on this call right here right now you're feeling a bit uneasy about trading whether it's in the harmonic scanner, DeLorean, um, Gold Cup or Vibrato or whatever it is, please, please speak to me. Please send me a message. My message is in the group, in the, in the Kynamite group. Just send me a private message and we can have a chat. The reason why I'm pushing ECC11 so much is because every single person, every single person, all 16 of us on this call, we should be making money. The, the ECC11 is a guaranteed 10 pip per trade strategy. So if you're someone I'm even new to this and thinking the videos are overwhelming I'm not quite sure what I'm doing I'm not you know I'm not getting the hang of trading please plug into my session it is on and write this down by the way Tuesday I'm going to be live 9 a.m uk time and 9 p.m uk time I appreciate there's some people on here outside of England so I'm saying uk time so 9 a.m 9 p.m Tuesday and on Thursday I'm going to be live three times 9 a.m 2 p.m and 9 p.m. UK time. So please, please ensure that you plug into that and you can see from scratch how to actually set up a strategy and how to take a trade. It is so simple in just three steps. So that's basically something that I just wanted to share with you. Um, if you're someone who's struggling right now on the trading side of things, please, please plug into my sessions. I would love to have you on there so I can show you how I'm making my money every day. For me personally, you know, aiming for 50, um, sorry, uh, 10 pips per trade. And say if you're taking three to five trades a day, that's 50 pips a day. That's 250 pips a week. That's a thousand pips a month. Now, depending on your risk management, think of the amount of money and pips that you could make just by, I shouldn't say money, but think of the amount of pips that you could make just by taking those trades. I love trading and i love ecc11 that's my kind of my baby at the moment so if you really really want to get serious with your trading plug into my sessions um uh, on those two days now the second thing that i wanted to sort of have a chat about which we don't really cover in the week to week sessions because we do 10 hours worth of trading training a week and one hour of building um, so we're quite heavily focused on the trading and all that sort of side of things as far as trainings are concerned we don't really cover mindset and we don't really cover the why. And I think that's so crucial in a business like this, because one of the things that has really kept me going over the last two years is my why. And whether you're a trader on this call, like a pure trader, or whether you're a builder, we have to have our why, because that is what's going to keep us going throughout the next week, throughout the next month, throughout the next year. Because trust me, at some point, you might blow an account. At some point, someone might drop out of your team. At some point, someone might say something to you that you don't like. And all these little things that happen along the way, all these little rejections or all these niggly things that happen, the, your why, our why will always keep us going. And I'm really, really excited uh, to say, uh, you know, for me, Platinum 5000 is around the corner now. Uh, very, very close. And the reason why I'm sharing that with you is because not only Platinum 5000 is on the cards very, very soon, but also I wanted to talk about environment, which is really, really important. My why is my parents. 
And that is what's kept me going over the last two years, oh, two years that I've been in this business. So when people say to me, well, how can we so energetic all the time? How come you are so full of, you know, you're just, you're just always energetic and you're saying things and you're doing things all the time. It's because I have a big vision and I'm sure I've, I think I've spoken to pretty much every single person who's on the call right now. Um, have your why in front of you, have your why in front of you. And a part of that is your environment. Now, right now, I'm, I know I made a joke, I'm in Dubai, you know, and I'm in this uh, lovely place, but my environment, or should I say our environment is so important. The people who you surround yourself with is important. The words that you read, the information that you look at, your eye gate and your ear gate is really important. And I think I spoke about this with you. I think it was this group, um, this team on uh, a couple of weeks ago when we had our last call. My mom was sitting in the, in the lounge and I was actually going to have a, a cup of tea with her. Um, and I went in the lounge with my cup and I walked straight back out. Why did I do that? Because my mum had the news on and I thought, I I'm sorry, mum, I can't watch this. I can't watch this because my eye gate and ear gate, all the reading, all the personal development, all the positivity that I've been doing is going to go to waste. If I just hear there's more DEA, THS, I don't want to say the word. There's, there's, there's things happening out there. It's not nice. I get it. What's happening out there, but I have to protect my ear gate and my eye gate because I'm goal focused. I have to focus on my goal, my goal are my parents. So if I'm talking negative, if I'm talking about the, the, you know, what rate, whether it's decreasing or increasing, if I'm focusing on, oh, the, the PM has it now, the prime minister has it now, what's happening with Boris? If I'm focusing on all these things, I am negating all the that I'm doing. Let me give you another example of um, environment. Look at this. Can you see this? Can you see this right here? This is basically a laminated $1 note, which is $120,000 written on it. So what, what, what's this all about? Well, basically, every time I look in my diary and I'm looking at all my, um, uh, you know, me, my diary is packed. Like, look at this. So every day there's something going on, um, Zoom calls with the team or one-to-ones or prospecting. Every time I open up my diary, I see this note. Why? Because this year I'm hitting Chairman 10. $120,000 a year is what I'll get paid. So my environment, and if I have a look around, like, around, my, around my environment, I can see everywhere, this is plastered everywhere. So the first thing I see is this note. Then when I go to the bathroom mirror, I'm brushing my teeth, it's the first thing that I see. I've even got it on my fridge. I had a, a, a chat with um, Artie a couple of um, weeks ago, I, I'm sure she won't mind me saying, she has her goals in her fridge. She's the lady that has the goals in her fridge because she knows it's, it's quarantine and she keeps opening the fridge and having a look like a lot of us do. So this is what she sees. She's seeing her goal. Now, if 120,000 is not your goal, think of a different goal. It might be platinum 600. It might be platinum 1000. So get yourself a note and just put on it with a marker what you wish to achieve. And the same goes for the traders on the call. It doesn't matter if you're just looking to trade or you, you hit some money or you're looking to build. At some point, uh, sorry, all of you will have a goal that, okay, I wanna earn a certain amount of money per, from trading per, per, um, per week, per day, per month. So start writing it down. Start writing down your goals. Trust me, this stuff works like a charm. And I remember when I started doing ECC 11 and, um, Again, I was, all these thoughts were going through my head. Can I do it? Can I not? And I started writing down, I'm a master trader. I'm a master trader. I'm so happy and grateful. I'm earning good money. I'm so happy and grateful. I'm catching pips. So again and again, I was feeding my mind with that information of a belief that I can do something. And you know what? Things are working. Like the, the results we've had in the last two weeks, the last three weeks even of me teaching this are great. So every time you write something down and you're, and you're, focusing on your goal that's what's really going to set us apart tonight i'm doing a call on um tonight i'm doing a call on uh, building the business so prospecting and handling objections but these are just skills i'm going to give you the real meat here right right here right now a lot of people say to me well how did you get to platinum 2k how are you you know learning so much uh, how are you such a good trader like how have you, have you learned learned learn and i said because i have my why 
I have my why. If I didn't have my why and I wasn't that bothered, I, I probably wouldn't make, I, I, I probably wouldn't have made it. I probably wouldn't have been able to retire in my early 30s and say, do you know what? Um, I've done it. I've been there. I've done that. A lot of people are going to work for the next 10, 20, 30 years, but we've got to make the decision how much we're going to work. Because trust me, when I saw on Scottish Widows that my pensionable age was 68 years old with a retirement annual income of £11,000 a year, I was not impressed. And I rejected that from my eye gate and my ear gate. I said, no. Do you know what I actually did? I actually ripped up the paper because I was fuming. I was like, I'm, I don't deserve this. After so many years of working, I'm going to be given £11,000 a year? And me being me, I thought it was per month. So I was like, this is fantastic. Oh my God, amazing. So when I read down the page and I thought it was, I saw it was 11,000 um, 11, a, a year, I thought, I'm not, I'm not settling for this. So then I started thinking about my parents. If that's my situation, what's it going to be like for them? And what about my siblings? We want to have a good, strong, comfortable lifestyle where parents don't have to worry about Oh, we've got to pay bills. We've got to pay mortgage. Oh, we, we want to go on a holiday. We can't afford it or this, that and the other. Their responsibility as they're now grandparents, their responsibility should be, let's take the grandkids out. Let's bake a cake. Let's do some gardening. That should be their priority. Not, oh, I need to, I need to, um, I need to pay the next bill that's coming out. I need to check my bank account. This is the way most people live. And shall I tell you how that, how I know that? Because I was that person before. I was that person who used to check my bank balance. Have I got enough? And in the second to third week of being paid my wages, I would have run out of money. Maybe many of you can relate to this. I would have run out of money. So it meant that in the last week I was scraping by thinking, okay, I won't go out for a meal. Maybe I'm not going to take out. Um, I won't see my friend for dessert. I'll just scrape by. It's, it's truth. I'm, I'm being so real with you here right now. That's how I used to live. I used to have my Barclays app on my phone and I used to check it. Wages have come in, fantastic. Bills have gone out, not fantastic. Want to change my life? How? So this was a real good opportunity to get out there and, and, and make something. And this is why when I speak to a lot of you, I will always ask you, what's your goal for earning an extra income? Not why do you want to trade? Why do you want to build? Forget that. They're just, that's just the stuff. But why do we want to earn an extra income? How much of that could impact our lives? Because watch this. In the corporate world, I was earning a, a decent wage. But think about it carefully. Why would someone like me decide to sack the boss? Because I'm earning good money. It's all good. It's all fine. What's the problem? Well, see, here was the thing. My health was not great because I was always stressed out. I felt my boss, you know, he, he, the managers and the bosses and directors were great. But the fact of the matter is, is that my time was never my own. And I missed my 30th, my friend, best friend's 30th birthday because work would not let me go. They said, sorry, um, we can't let you, we, we can't let you go because um, it's outside of term time. And you work in the education sector, so you have to abide by the rules. Let me tell you another interesting story what work did as well. I decided to go to Florida for five days, but that fifth day I had a flight back on Monday, right? So remember, bear in mind, education sector, and we're not supposed to take time out during the, um, in the term times. And do you know what they said to me? Because my, and me being me, miss, too honest sometimes, my flight was basically going to land at sort of around three, four o'clock in the afternoon. So that means I would have been back home in Leicester for about that time and work instead of saying to me, Oh, that's fine. Come back on Tuesday. My manager said, after you come home, could you come straight to the office for two hours to just, you know, you can show your face and you can check your emails and then you're ready for Tuesday. So that was basically the end of my holiday and the start of work. The day I landed from my, uh, this was another holiday I went on. The day that I landed, it was, okay, you've landed at four. You need to be in work for 4.35. Just finish off the last hour and that's it. So this is what I mean. The grass isn't always greener on the other side. My time was not my own. My health was not my own. I was, my sickness record was like up here because I was always stressed out. I wanted to be the best. I wanted to do the best. But because I was always stressed, 
my health wasn't good. I used to do, um, I used to have a lot of like fast food, crazy stuff, crazy, crazy stuff. But now, oh, and by the way, I never practiced gratitude either because I didn't believe in it. Again, I'm being totally real with you today. Totally, totally real. I just thought, oh, you know what? Uh, I wish I could have more stuff. She has this, he has that. Um, and, 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 and I was always operating from a place of, um, I was always operating from a place of lack and um not abundance i wasn't grateful because i always wanted more but i was always frustrated so guess what the universe said to me mandy you want frustration here's more here's a lot more here's a bit more stress because that's what you want so i had to change a lot of things trust me i have been through such a big process myself it is crazy because ultimately i thought to myself right it's time for a change because let me draw this out actually this is actually quite interesting it might actually help okay think of where you are in your life can can we see that i'll probably put it here think of think of where you are here this is now okay just just bear with me a second because this is really really important like very 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 important what i'm about to share with you okay so look at look at this this is where you are now and this is retirement now, I'm not going to ask anyone on the call or anything like that. You can see this yourself. But how far do you have until here? You might be here. You might be here. Or I don't know how close or how far away everybody is from retirement. But watch this. How long are you going to wait to make a difference? We are all part of this academy right now. So are you going to spend the next 10 years working, the next 20 years working, the next 50 years working? Or are you going to make a change here so that you don't have to worry about money and health? Because do you know what? The true meaning of um, the true meaning of wealth for me is not just money. It's having the time to spend with your loved ones. It's about having the health. It's about having the money to you know pay bills and not even bat an eyelid. It's about having that having the um, the money to go into a shop and not go to the discount side first because i've been there before my mum has been there before where she used to cut coupons clip coupons and say look let's wait for the sales let's wait for buy one get one free i'm not um uh, sorry I'm, I'm not being disrespectful to, to, to anyone by the way just so you're clear all i'm saying is that life should be about abundance so I said to mom, I said, I don't want you doing that stuff. I don't want you, um, you know, waiting for a sale to get something. You should be able to just buy it like that. Why aren't you able to buy it like that? So then it got me thinking that I've got to be the change. If you are not the first six figure earner in your family, or if, you, if there has not been six or seven figure earners before you, you, should, you need to be the next one, whether it's through trading, whether it's through building. But we've got to get out there and make it happen. And this is why goals, our environment like this, having stuff like this is so important. I remember the first time I saw this. Um, in fact, David was talking about it. David and Manita, our chairman 500. I've been to his house. Okay, I've been to his house when I went to Texas. We actually went to Houston when we went for the conference. His house is amazing. He has his goals everywhere. He has his goals on his fridge. He has it in his lounge. We even went into his bedroom. He's got it uh, just above his electric toothbrush and his, his bath and everything. He's got a picture of air, like planes everywhere because the next thing he wants to do is he wants to have his own private jet. So all around his hallway, his room, his bathroom, his kitchen, he's got pictures of jets everywhere. And then I sat in his Rolls Royce. Um, so that was, that, was quite a, that, that was quite a great experience. Um, I'm just trying to find a picture right here, right now. I, I've never sat in a Rolls Royce, by the way. Um, and honestly, that was so, so incredible. Um, if you just have a look at the, I don't know if you can see that. Here we go. Uh, there, just there, sitting in his Rolls Royce. That was in Houston, Texas. But the reason why I'm sharing this with you is not to impress you, it's to impress upon you. When your environment changes, things will change in your life. When you change the people around you, who are talking positive, it will have a positive impact in your life. When you change the self-talk that you say to yourself, it again will have a massive impact in your life. Massive, massive impact in, your, in, in our lives. Remember, the biggest enemy is ourselves. 
I was my own biggest enemy in the corporate world. I'm laughing because my journey to work used to be an interesting one. I used to get up, get ready and everything. And my journey for 20 minutes to work, because um, my work was quite close to my home, went like this. I've got to go for a meeting. Oh, I can't believe he made that comment. Is it? Okay, I'm nearly there. Traffic lights. Okay. And I do negative self talk every day. This was my daily routine for 20 minutes each morning. That's what I used to do. And when I came into this company, I remember Tiki saying to me, don't even listen to yourself. You're going to listen to 20 minutes of personal development. And that's when the journey started. I used to listen to uh, audios like The Secret, Bob Proctor, Tony Robbins, David Minitier. I started feeling gratitude, writing out goals. Um, okay, my goals book is there. That's fine. But I, I started really, really applying this information and feeling it and nurturing it. And honestly, it's made a big change. Trading, great income. Building, great income. But the changes have started. The changes started when I started. Everything starts with the tongue, remember. And this is what David talks a lot about. Life is in the power. Uh, sorry, uh, life and death are in the power of the tongue. So if you speak ill to yourself, I can't trade. I've blown an account. I don't believe in building. It's a pyramid. It's a scam. People only recruit in this business. Nobody knows how to trade. All these negative things. If you're saying that on, to yourself, trust me it's going to be hard for you to do anything. It's going to be hard for you to do anything. So what I always maintain is get good at trading, get good at mindset and get good at speaking to people. Cause what we have is impacting so many lives out there. Why not share it with people? Do you know, there was up to 200 people in my webinars last week when I was doing the, um, 150 to 200 people every time I did my session and they were all going crazy in the chat box because they were saying, Mandy, this strategy works. And our, our, we've hit TP already. We've hit take profit. This is amazing. Trades are hit, live trades are hitting death. So you've seen it for yourself. There and go and share it. The last thing I want to finish off with in the last few minutes of this call is the butterfly effect. You don't know the impact you can have on someone else. Watch this. Two years ago, I joined the business. Two years ago, I told my sister. She then had two children. Now, because she gave the business a go two years ago, the decision she made here now pays for what? Her mortgage, her son's nursery fees, and very, very soon her little girl's nursery fees when she starts. But had she not made that decision here, she would never have been in that position. And the other thing is, I'm very, very pleased to announce, is that she is going to be going back to work in September because that's when her maternity leave finishes, but she now has the choice not to go back. And we are so excited for her because I remember Kiran, um, she was very, very stubborn. My, my younger sister, she was saying, nah, I'm all right, thanks. Like I, I do sales and I'm good. And you know, she, she, I mean, she's, she's got it all. Like she's got the house, she's got the car, she's got the lifestyle, great. So very, very successful in her own right. But I said, Kiran, I love you, please listen because Trading, you know, it can make us some good money. We never know. Why don't you just try it for three months? And two years later, when she had her kids, look at where she is today. So look at the impact. Look at the butterfly effect. Had I not told her about this, she would still have been stressing. I had a lady in my team who's a mother of two. You've probably seen her on the on the on the uh, on the groups. Her name is Saba. Um, she's in a different team, but she missed her son's first steps because she was at work. And she said, you know what? I'm never, ever committing that mistake again. So she's really, really driving the business. Her why is so strong and that's her kids. If you don't have kids, your why might be your parents. Your why might just be yourself, that you want to do something for yourself. You're just fed up. You're just sick and tired of being sick and tired. And now's a change. Remember what I said at the beginning of this call, May is the month of overflow. That means blessings, gratitude, goals to be achieved. There's so much that we can do together. And just for this team, I just want to make sure everybody, yeah, that's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm uh, guessing, Jav, everybody, only this, this group in this team are, are pres present on this call. But for just this team only, we have an incentive running where um, we're knocking off $100 from the, um, the sign-up fee. So what that means is that Instead of paying $235, every customer will pay $135 for the platinum pack. 
for the for the um, for the elite pack instead of 325 they'll pay 225 and the way it will work is like this when a customer registers any new customer they will pay the full amount and after one week we will give them the hundred dollar refund in their bank account or through PayPal this is just for this team here for the 17 people on this call this is not to be mentioned on social media this is not to be mentioned on any other group chat this is specifically for our group this is an intimate team incentive just for the people on this call uh, and, and sorry within the Kynamite group so run with it tell people show people if you are not sure how to speak to someone, if you are not sure about, oh, I'm scared about they might judge me because I don't know how to trade. Hello, plug them into me, plug them into Dr. Jav, because we have enough experience to handle objections. I've seen all sorts over the last two years. I've had so much stuff thrown at me. Um, I like a challenge. So I, I welcome your prospects to come and have a chat with me. Don't worry, I'm not going to scare them away. It's all good. It's all good. Um, but, you know, I can have a chat with them. Dr. Jav can have a chat with them and just show them, look, this is what we do. Would you like to give it a go? This is what we do. Would you like to give it a go? Just share the opportunity with people because guess what? If someone hadn't shared the opportunity with you, you wouldn't be here today. You wouldn't be on this call today. We would not be connected. So think about the impact that you can have on other people, your friends, your family, the loved ones around you. I'm really, again, happy to say we, my family, we do it as four of us. There's four of us siblings that do it together. It's a very rare mix, but we love it. Like me, Kiran, Raj, the Rajan, we're the four that do the, we, we do the business together as a four. And it's so good. We have so much fun with it. So the point I'm trying to make in summary is number one, have your why. Number two, environment. Write down your goals and plaster them and i mean plaster them everywhere because that's so important what you look at what you see is what you get if you're constantly looking at lack that's what you're going to get if you're constantly looking at the you're going to get that right and uh, thirdly spread the word share it with people and show them what a fantastic opportunity this is you know so i've shared a lot of personal things about about me with you today um i hope that's been useful i kind of just wanted to share a bit about my journey it's not always been rosy i have had my highs and lows and ups and downs but enjoyed every single minute of it so jab thank you so much for inviting me on this call back to you and again everybody if you need me please contact me always a phone call away thank you very much thank you mandy thank you so much um that was absolutely awesome um can you all give mandy a shout out um drop a few sevens uh, in the chat box now, I took some notes there, Mandeep. So um, for the benefit of everybody, note takers are money makers. So I'm just going to do a, a quick overview of what Mandeep was talking about because I relate to every single thing that she talked about. Firstly, um, trading. Um, scalping is, is, is a very, very good strategy. Uh, in my opinion, it's, it's a very good beginner strategy. And ECC 11 is very, very easy to learn. In fact, a seven-year-old will get it after a few times. So my recommendation to every single person on this call is that if you're not scalping at the moment, give it a go. Um, even if you're making 10, 10 pips a, a trade and you're doing multiple trades in a single day, you can get your monthly feedback in a day. And I've seen this over and over again. And obviously scalping is one of many, many strategies that we use. And for a beginner, uh, I'd recommend you look at scalping, look at ECC 11. It's a very, very easy uh, one to get a hang of. Now, Mandy talked about the, the eye gate and ear gate, and this is something I do myself as well. And in, in my particular case, if you, you've met me in person, you will know that if you speak to me in a negative way, I will walk away. And I've done this for years. I cannot handle negativity. And again, you need to operate from this same place. Try and get negativity out of your life. If, if you're surrounded by negativity, your life will become negative and it's not the place to be because negativity harnesses disease. It also um, impacts you in, in a widely, widely manner um, and it will never, never help you push through. And I, I love the, the $1 note that, that Mandeep has abused and made into a $120,000 note. And the reason that makes me laugh is because I've done the same thing as well. And also, if you come to my house, you'll notice... Um, some you know some quite wild and big golds all over the place 
and this is what I recommend every single person to, you, to do. I talked about goals earlier um, in this presentation. And again, my recommendation is that you should know your goal and please ensure that your goal is everywhere so that you are moving towards it on a daily basis, on a, on a, on an hourly basis, on an every single minute basis, you should be pushing towards your goal. And what else? Man, yeah, many talks about obviously working in a job. I've been there. I've been in the corporate space. My corporate pension wasn't very good. Um, I was earning a good living, but I was working 60 to 80 hours a week. And that's when I decided to start on my entrepreneurial journey. Now, before I go, I just want to talk about Mike Tyson. If you know who Mike Tyson is, please drop me a, I don't know, 555 in the chat box. When I was, a, a, you know, much younger than I am today, I used to watch Mike Tyson and he was a beast. Now, Mike Tyson obviously reached the pinnacle of, of his career in boxing. In my opinion, <clears throat> he was one of the, the toughest fighters we've ever known. And I want to share before I go a few quotes that I, I, I came across uh, when listening to some Mike Tyson interviews. So I'm going to go through these. And the reason I'm going through these is because every single one of these quotes is applicable to this business. Size and style are not the most important things in the ring. It's your determination, will to win and desire that will make you champion. I'll say that again. Size and style are not the most important things in the ring. It's your determination, will to win and desire that will make you champion. You don't have to be the biggest, the hardest, the strongest fighter in the world to become a world champion. Like Mike Tyson said, it's your willingness to succeed. You need to want it like your next breath of fresh air. If you're in that position, you will make it. You do not need to be the baddest fighter in the world or the biggest fighter or the strongest or the quickest. What's more important than all of that is your willingness to want it. The same applies to this business. You don't have to be the best trader. You don't have to be the best person at, at prospecting or presenting. It's got to be your willingness to do well. I'd write this down if I were you. It's your willingness to succeed that will push you through the many hurdles that you will come across. Mike Tyson also said that everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Again, the same applies to this business. Everybody has a plan. Things seem to be going very, very well until you get punched in the mouth. Now, in, in, in business, in trading, it doesn't make a difference. Things can be going extremely well. You can be having, I don't know, 20 amazing positive trades, but your next trade could see you lose all your money that you've made in, in the first 20 trades. <coughs> when it comes to building your business, you may be P1000, P2000, but 90% of your team might leave the next day and you'll get knocked down. It's the same in boxing. You need to push through these barriers. You need to push through the negativity. And I can guarantee you this will happen. In my business, I've personally brought in probably about 50 or 60 people and I've seen 80% of them leave. So people come, people go, but the people that stay will make your business into a multi-million pound operation. The same thing applies to trading. In trading, you will do extremely well, but then the next trade might see you lose a lot of your profit. It's the people that carry through these punches in the mouth that make it. So you need to become resilient and make sure that you keep going no matter what, because that is the only way that you will make it. Mike Tyson also said, I'm confident I can beat any fighter in the world. So confidence is extremely important in business. Obviously, skill set is important as well. But once you have the confidence, you will push yourself to succeed. If you hang around with successful people, people that are making the six, seven plus figures in this business, you'll see how we operate and you'll see our energy levels. And by spending time with these people, you'll find that it will rub off onto you as well and your energy will increase as a result of it so very very important have the confidence of a chairman 500 and you will make it <coughs> i'm the best ever mike tyson said that to himself over and over and over again i'm the best ever and because he said it to himself so many times he became the best ever mike tyson was not the strongest he wasn't the tallest he wasn't the biggest he wasn't the quickest but when you put all those things together, 
he became a world champion over and over again because he said to himself, I'm the best ever. Muhammad Ali said the same to himself as well, I'm the greatest, over and over again. And it, that phrase became coined with Muhammad Ali. So affirmations are so, so important in your business. And in a further training, I think we will talk about affirmations because affirmations are, are, are key to your success. And Mandeep touched upon this as well. Gratitude and affirmations come hand in hand. Every single day when I wake up in the morning, I'm grateful for very, very many things. And I go through these one at a time so that these things put me in my place and ensure that I move towards my goal every single day. I'm a dreamer. I have to dream and reach for the stars. If I miss a star, I grab a handful of clouds. Mike Tyson said that. I go for the stars. If I miss the stars, I'll get a cloud or get a few clouds. So what I'm saying to everyone on this presentation, on this call, is that aim for Chairman 500. If you want to become Chairman 500, let me know. Let Mandeep know. And we are here to support you. We know what it takes to become Chairman 500 because both myself and Mandeep are going to become Chairman 500 very, very soon. It's all about duplication. It's all about replication. If you want to hit that level, let us know and we'll give you all the tools you need to get there. My name's Dr. Jav. Again, thank you for being on this presentation. Please um, don't just um, listen to what we said. Take on board what we said and, and please do take action as well. I'd like to thank every single person who's made it to this presentation. Thank you. Thank you so much for being on here. Thank you, Mandy, for, for, for your training as always. And again, guys, um, it doesn't matter where you're based in the world. We all have the human DNA and we can do it. We're no different to you. We've reached a certain level in this business and there's no reason why you can't do it too. Just because David Mnitia is making, I don't know, quite you know, very, very good income a month. He's channel 500, channel elite. There's no reason why you can't do it too. We have the skills in front of us to do it. Let's get there and let's get there together. My name is Dr. Jav. I look forward to our next call and let's speak soon and keep in touch. Thank you and God bless.